Yeah, so I'm uh, back after a four year holiday and uh, yeah, I've decided to do some uh, career mode. Yeah, let's just get into it. Right, um, I decided to go my favourite team in the Premier League. It's obviously Aston Villa, of course it is. God, who else would you think it would be? Anyway, I'm going to Aston Villa. I've added the funds because we need everything we need. We just need all the work help we can get, really. World class, five minutes, lenient, Sterling, the park, a couple of chip buddies. Can't get any better than that, can you boys? Let's go! I'm still very excited about Future Ram. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's gonna be one fucked up cream mod. If you came here to watch cream mod, which is gonna be fun, exciting, you know, but I know cream mod stuff, just, uh, well, you came to the wrong place because it's gonna be an absolute fuck up. And we're just going to try and hope we can win this some games, really, and, uh... Alright, so, which one do we pick? The European Shield, the European Cup, or the Champions Trip? Which one would look cooler in your basement? That's what I'm trying to say. I want that one, because that one looks fucking sick. Yeah, we'll go with that one. Fuck, fuck how much money we get. We've probably got about loads of money already, anyway, so... How much have we got? How much have we got? 27.2 million. Basically... 27.3 but that's a lot of money right i'm just gonna get rid of all these messages and whatever the fuck this crap is and right so i've sorted out all the shit that needed to get rid of all. and basically they want me to finish mid table and round 16 in the cup which might be a problem because i'm really bad at cream mode and all that shit anyway let's just have a look at this team yeah right um basically we do oh my god is that mark Ban? No. Oh my fucking god, we got Mark Button. Well shit this goalkeeper to grace the earth. Mark fucking button. Give him a run. Round of applause. If you're not clapping, he just fucking deserves one because he's that bad. Anyway, we basically got a shit team, I'm not gonna lie to you. Most of these players are probably gonna be leaving um, in this transfer window. So you say goodbye to them. Now, yeah, piss off, fucking cunts. Well, I'm gonna make some, uh, I'll add some players to the shortlist now. I know I'm doing this a lot, but I gotta do it, I gotta get in some new players. Okay, so, so I've shortlisted some players who I really, I just wanna sign. I'm not the best at signing players, I've just put some down, down some players who I really like. And here they are. As you can see, I've got. A bunch of players, I don't know exactly the amount I've got, but here we go, let's just start from the top. First of all, i got this guy, Dominic Ifora. I did look on footwards for the potentials. Sorry if you pissed off, but I didn't know. You can't just tell the potentials from, I can't be asked to scout them anyway. So he's got 81 potential, and he's an absolute giant. He's like six, yeah, exactly, look at that, six foot four. One absolute giant, and he's 20 years old as well, and he's going to be a beast really good, so I put him down. Hector Bellerin, you know, really, really pacey, really, really good. Then I've got this guy, Kurt Zuma. He's probably going to be a, pr a pricey, but hopefully if I can do some swap deals with some players, I might be able to afford him. Next I've got, well, I've got two Leicester players in here. I've got Ray Mahrez and Vardy. Ray Mahrez, you all know who he is. I don't need to explain him. Aaron Lennon, I still think he's got something in me. You know, he's still 28. hasn't reached that 30, 30 age mark yet. Still got pace. and He's he's playing quite well for Everton at the moment, guys. So, yeah, I've got him down. Yuri Tellmans, now I've heard from a lot of people, he's a really good guy, he gets really high potential, I think he's got like 91 potential, 90 potential, I'm not too sure, but really good potential, 18 years old, he's gonna grow guys, he's re he looks really good as well, so, and then obviously I had to go from him, didn't I, Deli Ali, what a beast in centre mid, now Yannick Balassi, I just love using this guy, and I can see myself winning some, like, Catching wins in games with this guy, but well, he's just pace, his height, his strength. It's really, really gonna help me out with this guy's. Really wanna sign him. He's my main priority. Yannick Balassi, definitely gotta sign him. And then last but definitely not least, Jimmy Vardy, the record breaker himself. What an absolute beast. Hopefully, I can get a lot of these players in, but I, I gotta get rid of uh, some of the shit first we got on this team. Right, let's just um, spend some cash. Okay, so if you have noticed already, I did inquire about Yannick Balassi. I'm so, so eager to get this guy. He's so, so beast. Another player I am going to inquire about, though, is uh, Yuri Tillemans. I'm just going to give him a go. 
See what he did to that. Let's just uh, inquire about him now. Bang. There we go. Bang, bang, bang. Good deal. Right, and also Raid Mares. We'll just do it for now. We're going to get the two last to buy Zoom. We'll do Mares and we will also do Jimmy Vade. Wait. What's going on? They won't let me inquire. Oh, I, oh no, I must have already inquired when my memory is absolutely shit. Right, and in the back, I'm going to leave Zuma for now because I can see those players we've just inquired about are going to be quite pricey. So, I'm going to see how much Deli Ali's worth, see how much you know I can get him for because he has got good potential. I think he's got like 87 potential, so he's really good. And, um, yeah, we'll try out 4 out as well because like, he's 6 or 4, I can probably play him centre back. Maybe even CDM if his ball control and that gets better. So, yeah, those are players I'm quite good so far. Okay, and, so we've got uh, some players leaving on international duty. I'm guessing it's like the American Cup or some shit like that. Brad Guzan Sanchez. Wasn't even planning on playing them anyway, so it really doesn't matter. Blasi, 10 million, right. That really isn't that bad, to be honest with you guys. I'll probably play that, but let's just see Telemans and i 4 one in just a sec. 14 fucking million! Christ, I didn't realise he was going to be that much. 14 million for a fucking 18 year old. Are you having. Oh my fuck, I'm. What the fuck? Oh Jesus Christ, that's really fucked up my hopes now. Right, okay. Let's move on. Dominic I4, let's just see what it is. Uh, wait, oh wait, there. Dominic I4, we must inform you that we have no interest. So he doesn't. Well, they don't want him to leave because he's a good player. Right, okay. Right, so. Let's just go on offer Balassi what he wants. Actually, no, we'll try and get a bit lower. Try and use my uh, tactical, financial, whatever the fuck. Oh, I don't even know what I'm saying. Right, we're going to try, yeah. We'll try 7.5. We'll try to be, be a bit cheeky if we can get him for that. we still got 19 million left. I don't really want to give up anyone for Balassi. I just want to get him straight with the money. Now, you tell the man, I'm going to try and offer a player because I can't go paying 14 million for an 18-year-old this early when he just could be an absolute fucking flop so um let's just see what players we've got right so we've got a core we got we got some players we can put i don't know what rate i think he's like 75 76 rated i want to offer him somebody good so they'll give him but also somebody i don't need um i, I really don't know what to give him right ah, all right we'll give him we'll give him sanchez yeah might as well Give him Sanchez. I'm not going to use him. I don't like him. He's quite slow. We'll have to offer a bit of money as well. Let's offer... Um, let's try 3.5. We'll try that and uh, let's just see what happens from there. I'm not going to offer i4 yet. And yeah, we'll just see what happens with Tealmans. Right, we have got some messages back. Jamie Vardy, 4.8. That is cheap as fucking chips. Don't mind if I do. And Mares, 10 million. I was kind of expecting that as well. I probably can get Mares a bit cheaper though. Now, Ali, the big one. Spurs are not interested in discussing his value. Well, he's going to want to come. He's, they probably want to play him on career mode. Anyway, it's just all for Jimmy Vardy. Get him in the party, if you know what I'm saying. Right, um, let's just try and get him a bit cheaper again. 2.9, we'll try and be a bit cheeky and try that. Hey, okay, Namarez, 10 million. That's a lot of money. I don't want to go paying that much. I already kind of paid that for Balassi. So, we're going to offer a player. Not too sure who to offer. Um, fuck, I didn't put a keeper down, did I? I don't want Guzan. Ah, oh, fuck. Right. Carlos Gill. He's got a skinhead. Looks like he's just got out of prison. Fuck him. Just get rid of him. Oh, shit. I can't offer 10 million as well. Jesus Christ. Not made of money. Right. We're going to offer 1.5 million with. No, not 1.4. Absolute spaz. Right, 1.5. Deal is done. Crystal Palace have accepted for Balassi. Now that is very, very good. Right, he wants 60k a week. Might as well just give him what he wants. Isn't? You can't argue with wages. Three years, mind. Right, we'll begin 5%. Crucial first team player. He's definitely going to play loads. Andre Green. Hey, boss. I was hoping you might be experimenting with the squad and give me a chance to play. I'm not even playing it, so yeah, you can piss off. Andre Green, what the fuck are you? Don't talk to me like that, piece of shit. Right, also in talk to West Brom, Jimmy Vardy. Oh, fuck, they've offered more. We're going to have to pay a little bit more if we want Vardy. So, right. Fucking hell, 
come on. There it is. Alright, Jimmy Vardy, two transfer offer. Come on, come on. Right, there it is. Oh, you're just gonna be. Oh, fucking hell. I don't wanna do this, man. Alright, 3.9, Jimmy Vardy, come on. You gotta come, mate. You're destined to join Villa. Get your pack your bags, come to Birmingham. Enjoy your last of your life, mate. Right, now we have got Verona in a friendly. I'm not gonna play that. Alright, and let's just skip it. Oh my god, we just won 3 0 against Hellas Verona. Jesus fucking Christ. Agbani scored two, and Ayu with one goal. Jesus fucking Christ. What a. Jesus. They probably didn't get any shots on Mark Bunn, that was the problem, probably. Mark Bunn is absolutely shit. Fuck, I've roasted him to him, right? Jesus. Alright. If we increase the cash sum to 9.7, they're in. No, actually, no, I'll pay that, but that's only bad. I'll play 9.7 for that guy. That jokes, 8.5, not paying that fucking much. Jesus Christ. Right, let's just keep advancing. Oh, if Yuri Tillemans is playing he scores, that's not really going to look good, is it really? Even though, it, okay, we're just going to offer them what they want now. They're interested in the player, but... Gotta offer a little bit more or a little bit less in this case for Mares. Kind these deals are going so quick, man. Alright, now. And elect. Hopefully Tielemans in playing and if he well, I actually hope he scores because it just looks better on me because I'm trying to sign him. Alright, we'll give him 40 for three years. I don't know exactly want to leave. He's got massive pace. And we'll say, fuck it, crucial, he's going to be playing a lot. Gestead's going to be like coming on and that. So, got a funny idea what I want to do. Definitely not the formation we'll be playing so far. If we've been on the leg now, I'll be really, really surprised because I think they're like a Champions League team, If I correct me if I'm wrong, but 1 0 win again. No, not again, but we won again. Jordan Ayew with a goal. Yes, come on. Oh my god, hallelujah. Balassi. The first sign-in for Aston Villa Cremo 2016 under the raging ram. He's actually like God in my eyes. Look, like, Jesus, he's he's so high up. Like, he's he's fucking beast, isn't he? Yes, he's accepted as well. Brilliant. Oh my God, fit. Now nah, we'll go for 20. Jesus Christ, for five years. All my days. This guy's gonna be fucking beast, man. Right, Mares, he's accepted as well. Brilliant. I just want to get all these signings in before we end this episode. Alright, crucial first team player. Bang, bang, bang. Don't mind if I do. Right, and Jimmy Vardy's accepted as well. Come on! I'll trust this team to win on Sims and that. To be honest with you, I think Mark Bunn's kept a clean sheet. Yeah, he has. Jesus Christ. Oh my fucking God! Oh my God. Vardy didn't score, so be worried, but Balassi scored. Their dudes, I can't even say that name, scored. And Ayu scored. 5 1. But Mark Bunder learned the goal. He's probably like a. Oh, text. Fuck off. Mares Tielemans has accepted. Get in there. Mares, welcome to the club, my friend. Yes, I managed to sign both of them. I've got 1 million left as well. Okay, so I've done all the tactics and all the stuff I wanted to do. I haven't touched the defense one bit, just saying. I'm still a bit shaky on the midfield, even though we have got two lands in there now. Maybe it might be one more replacement in the midfield or some, some, something like that. So I'm starting to start there now, Jesus Christ. Right, but my top three I'm really, really happy with. Balassi, Vardy and Mares. Absolutely really, really happy with that. And uh, yeah, that's the team, guys. And if you wanted to see all of this, I've done, I haven't really touched the roles. Done a bit of the instructions. And the tactics, high pressure. So... This be playing like Leicester. Oh, for fuck's sake. We lost 2-1. Fuck! Alright, El Ganazi and Yonex score. Crap. They have got a really good team, mind. But Balassi scored. He scored in two goals in two games. Really, really promising from uh, him. But yeah, guys. All I want you to do for me now is just comment down below who you want me to sign. You know I'm weak in the team, guys. Like the goalkeeper, the whole back four, and some of the midfielders, really. You know, like my scouts, you like tell me the players to sign and that, and I just sit in my chair, be a lazy shit as usual. Anyway, sorry for such a long video, guys. The first Korean mod video is always going to be long. You go and watch any big YouTuber who does Korean mod, their first video is always really, really like lengthy. 
Thanks for watching this video guys. If you could drop a like, subscribe and share this video around, I'll be really really grateful. Anyway, that's been it for me. I'll see you next time. Peace!